it's the biggest part of my balloons and I'm gonna tie it in a garland. We can do it different way, but I'm gonna start from small clusters to bigger one. I have different sizes and we're gonna grow it. So I'm attaching my fisher line clusters. And I'm wrapping my fisher line around balloons. And pull. Wrap and pull. Pull just a little bit, not too much, so we don't cut balloons. So I'm gonna gonna take a little bigger. We wrap all four balloons. So even if you pop somehow one balloon. Nothing's gonna just be destroyed, so it's gonna hold anyway. Okay, I'm slowly growing balloons bigger, bigger. Depends from the idea, you can start straight from the big balloons, but today I'm gonna do this way. garland right now I'm just doing a part which one can fit in my car so something like this so the rest I'm gonna cut and I'm gonna use a big bag for this partition And I'm gonna put my balloons inside so it's easy to carry to my car and to my plant. And the rest of the balloons I'm gonna put in another bag. Bag like this, uh, I think uh, can fit 20 balloons, 20, around 20, 11 inch balloons. We don't fill up until the end. So we can actually tie the bag. So like this. In my car I can fit three bags easy, maybe four. 
if I use a front seat. Yes, I have a CV, medium CV. So three, four bags you can fit. Today we are working outside. It's so hot, so hot, we melting. Melting? Yeah. My whole body It's horrible. It's horrible. Our balloons are popping. It's so hot. Oh my god, it's so bad today. So we put in shadow. Yes, no Shit shadow, out. nothing. Like. There you go. Okay. Flash forward party. Yes. I use glue dots to attach foil balloons and I use a ribbon band to attach latex balloons.
we have a lot of trouble. It's wind, it's heat, and the grass. Today we had to put plastic bag because every time when balloon touch the grass, it pops. We're gonna hide it as much as we can when we finish. But we have to leave it here, otherwise it's gonna pop.